Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Sonali from It Starts at Home and today I'm sharing a book with you that I've made for 7 to 8 years old kid and it primarily has maths, science and brain teaser activities so I'm gonna just get started very very quickly. You first have a puzzle that you need to resolve, you need to add these two, get a number and by solving the equation you have to figure out what's the number for this, what's the number of this and what's gonna come right here. So that's the first activity. The second activity is that you have to look at the numbers, start from here and there are some statesmen, statements given to you. You have to navigate your way either left or right, down or up and then uh, the answers are right here. So you have to figure out three squares to the right, three squares up. You go left and right and then you wherever you reach, uh, that's going to be the number here. So it's a pretty great uh, math plus a brain teaser activity that I have uh, shared with you right here. Everything starts from number 45 as the instruction says. So every time you do a question, you start from here. Okay, don't get tricked. So that's a great, great number recognition uh counting plus a color activity so one one three one you need to color them blue you need to count all of them especially one one three one and then write them here then one three one one you need to color them all red count them and write them there so for the green one so i think it's a pretty tricky activity like every time a child has to remember that he needs to uh, color one one three one as blue and then he needs to add all of them or just total up and write it here then you have these balloons, set the balloons free. You have a couple of equations here, which is from A to L. And I have given them all of them a code. So the kids have to resolve them and put it right here. So this uh, book is again made for a uh, pretty little girl. And I love the way she does the activities. She was the first one for whom I made the activity. And again, this is the first edition that I made for her. Now it says, how many circles count and write and go slow? There are, trust me, many circles that you think uh, just while seeing that there are, but there are many more than that. that you have to count very slowly and gradually. There might be a trick. Uh, you have to figure it out and count and write. Okay, then what is the rule on top? What will come in the empty space? You have these four brain teaser activities. Um, you have to see what's the rule going on the top. And then you have to see what comes here. So if like this is half portion, what comes here? This, 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 this. I'm going to tell you this is the one that's going to come here. Okay. So like here, you have another two activities and that's how you're going to resolve. You have all the options from A to D. Either you can draw or you can write the number. Uh, that's totally up to you. Then you have a code breaker. These two activities I've picked up from my code breaking activities, which I've done in the past. This is like creating words. This is like solving an equation. You can always... Uh, rather than using a plus, you can use a minus multiplication division or a multiplication, sorry, or a plus or whatever I think your child can do. You can always add that up. You can always change the numbers, make them more complicated or make them easy. But the coding elements remains the same. Now you have the science section, which is about volcanoes. So here I have uh, tried putting on one page some very important information about volcano. Uh, I have mentioned the gases that come out, how the volcano, the name has been derived. I've shown the inner crust, types of volcanoes, where are volcanoes fine. You find volcanoes, the tallest volcano. And then there are these four questions that you have to answer. The first three questions you can answer from here. The fourth one, you have to either use books or internet to figure out the answer. So it's a great way to involve the kids in science. I've picked up the a very easy topic but uh, month on month for all the books that I will be making I'm going to be making up different different topics I'm going to be like uh, jotting down the points here we'll be asking questions with trivia and some information and then going forward there's an experiment which will uh, coincide with the activity so here we're going to make lava lamp uh, you have to make uh, you have to draw two different types of volcanoes and name them and then here you have an experiment where I have given you the material that is required, the instructions, how you need to do, and this needs uh, adult supervision. So I think that's a great way of doing something. And here you are going to write and draw about your experiment. So you will have your thesis right here. Whatever you figured out, whatever you saw, you have to just write it down. So guys, I hope you like my video. And if you like it, just give me a thumbs up. If you want a printable of this video, um, do let me know. The paid printables are definitely available. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.